Hello everybody and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today I have for you a quick tutorial. I'm going to be showing you how to build this compact 1-4 to four tick pulse T flip flop. Now the name should be pretty self explanatory but for those of you who don't know what this is, a T flip flop will alternate between two outputs which are represented by the gold blocks every time you give this an input. And we can customize this output to be between the length of 1-4 to four ticks. So the delay between the input and the output is actually the same as the amount of ticks that the output is. So if you have a one tick output, then that's going to be one tick delay between pressing the input and getting the output. And if you have four, then it's going to be a four tick delay before you actually get the output. So this could be incredibly useful. Now just to give you a quick demonstration of how this works, let's set this both to one tick. So you can see that one tick passes through into the output there. So this is what happens with a one tick pulse and a sticky piston it'll extend the block out but it won't retract it and then it will retract it back in again and then you can set this to whatever amount of ticks you like and it will give you that pulse each time you press the input so this thing is really easy to understand how it works first of all to create that one to four tick pulse we are using this piston here so when we power this block we power the piston and this redstone powers this block which means the repeater can then pull um, a signal out of that based on how many ticks it's set to then behind here what we have is an RS NOR latch. So at the moment this side of the latch is activated which means it's going to lock this repeater here so the signal can only pass through on this side. And then that's going to activate this side of the RS NOR latch which is then going to turn on this torch and lock this repeater. So that's the way that we alternate the outputs each time. So let's start the tutorial. To build this you're going to need 20 building blocks, 2 redstone torches, 6 repeaters, a sticky piston, a button and 7 pieces of redstone. And we're going to start off by placing 7 blocks like this and then we're going to mirror that shape on the other side over here. Then place down 2 blocks at the back and 2 at the front. These ones are going to be your output. Then a block here with a sticky piston facing upwards behind it and then we're going to put down our redstone. So we have 1 piece at the front and three pieces at the back on either side. Then we can put down our two torches in these positions and that's gonna make the RS NOR latch. And then we'll place a repeater here and here facing in this direction. And then in this direction, we're gonna put another two repeaters, but these need to be right clicked three times so that they're on the fourth setting. And then last of all, all you need to do is put down a repeater here and a repeater there and a button at the front. And then it's these repeaters that you can change to change the tick length of the output. And so let's press this and see it in action. You can see that side got activated and then this side. And so that is your T flip flop right there. So if you'd like to download this, there'll be a schematic link in the description box. But other than that, thank you for watching and I will catch you next time.